write the story is an idea. Now, can anybody tell me, guess, what the question I get asked most as an author? Um, what's your favourite thing? <laughs> no, 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 it's not. What's your idea story? How did you get your idea? That's it. it yeah. What inspires you? Yeah, basically, it, I get asked, where do ideas come from? That is the question I get asked all the time. And can anybody tell me the answer to that? Has anybody got any idea where you get ideas from? Everything around you. Everything around you, very good. Ideas are absolutely everywhere. So maybe we should call him Super Bunny, but his actual real name's Pete. Do you think? Yeah. So, so maybe when he is wearing his mask, he's Super Bunny, and when he's not, he's called Pete. Would we be happy with that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So basically, our dilemma is the cat is eating all the cookies, he is raining and lightning on those who make the cookies, and nobody else is getting cookies. So we want cookies for everyone, and Super Bunny is going to save the day and get cookies for everyone. Cookie Catastrophe by the Otters. <laughs> and Pully the Buff. Okay, this is Cat King Cookie. He lives on a lonely cloud way up in the sky in Cookie Land. Page two. All the mice who live in Cookie Land cook cookies for Cat King Cookie. It's a bit of a tongue twist. <laughs> twist <laughs> <this time. laughs> he didn't eat. If he didn't eat cookies, he might eat mice. But the mice got fed up with Cloudy Land and cooking cookies. They ask for the help of Super Bunny. <laughs> Super Bunny said, "I have a plan. You must keep cooking cookies." Oh, said the mice, a little disappointed, but they kept cooking cookies. More cookies! Boom King Cat Cookie, and he rained on the mice from his cloud. Way up high. So the little m wet mice kept on cooking cookies. I need even more cookies, fellow Cat King Cookie, sending down forks of lightning from his angry clap. So, the frightened little mice kept on cooking cookies, more cookies than ever before. So many cookies that King Cookie got fatter and heavier and fatter until King Cookie had sunk to the ground. Without a cloud or a big cat in the sky, the sun came out, dazzling the whole of Cookie Land.
actually made this book because it's quite messy. It's got lots of glue on it. He has very, very messy hair. <coughs> Your hair needs brushing, said Fred Mess's mum. But Fred Mess doesn't like being brushed, brushed, brushed. So instead, he wears a spotty hat. One day, a gust of wind blew a spotty hat on Fred's head just like that. Fred Mess's hair was even messier than ever. Mess, mess, mess. So Fred chased his hat all the way to Hatland. Danny Stark lives in Hatland. He has a pond full of floating hats. Can I have my hat back, please? said Fred Metz. No, quacked Danny Stark. I like hats. So Fred Metz fished his hat. He caught a wizard hat. Fresh, fresh, fresh. 